Alright, how's everybody doing? Welcome back. This is the channel Brassy Trigger. We are in organized phase mode. Yes. Paul is here in his organized phase, and we'll see what has happened so far. Well, no new monsters, so that's kind of a letdown. Let's see now. You sacrificed a, uh, a uni, so you need to regain a 40 point buck, or. Let's see, what is that? 90 points and 40... So you got 45 points you can get for the top part. Well, let's see what we can summon in this area, shall we? Hell or Centaur? I'll go with the Centaur. Come hell or high water, whatever. <laughs> uh, so, that's going there. Do you want to name them real quick? Um... You know how to name them? No, I don't. I'll show you. Back out, go to names. I'll tell everybody how to name him too. Click on him, go all the way to the very far right one, and the one just down below that. Down one, click that, and go left. X is cancel and circle is confirm. Okay. And the very bottom right button is overall confirm. Just hit just hit X all the way. You 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 knock everything out. Oh. You have to knock out the words first. Oh, okay. What's a space? It's right there on the right. See it? You're next to the star. Oh. It's underscore. There's no invisible space like there was in the other one. Oh, okay. But this one actually gives you four languages. The one on the top switches between, I think, Japanese and Chinese. And uh, the other one, I, I can't remember what. And what's the overall confirm? Far bottom right. Oh. Hot shot. So. Hot, there you, there you go. Shot, I guess. Everybody gets to see this now. It's yes. no longer a secret anymore, I'm so sad. I wanted it all to be a secret, only I knew. Well, everyone, all our viewers, you can keep a secret, right? Good. Thanks. That helped me out. Give me some uh, mental agility. Do things Do things a little better from now on. Yes. Something to that degree. Alright, so you can't really do anything. Can oh, you, can you man. Class? I'm, I'm trying. Oh, Tinkerbell is close so, to classing. Yeah, Tinker, look, I got a lot of guys really close. Well, what, what else could you class? Could, oh, Isophis is close. Is he going to be Guardians? Oh. With one more battle, he could you need very to, well You need be. to get a kill and a win. Yep. I think. Or a couple shots of something. Yeah, but that's all I can really do for my organized phase. I mean. Nothing more? Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to put a defensive team here. Well, can eventually. you class up anybody on Lance's team? There's got to be someone we could class up. On Lance's team? Or on uh, Kai's team? Cause no, they're they're all they're, these guys are close too though. But I already got a number of high tier guys though. But like I got level well, eight Griffin. Yeah, yeah. They're they're high, but and none not... of those leaders. Those are all specialty leaders. They can't class yeah. on anything, anyways. Yeah. All right, so I guess it's my turn. I'm wondering where should I attack next? Oh, what you're thinking about attacking? Well, those guys aren't going to do much, really, unless you, you want to form another team here. I usually could. Yeah, you can. Bert, say, what else? Jennifer and. Oh, that's a little eight. So, so you're gonna take these guys off me. Look at that. It's not the best team, but, you know, I mean, with these, with, uh, you know, Sierra, Jennifer, two magic users, and Biarte, might be able to hold off a little bit. Mm -hmm. As long as we can knock, um, Fedor, <coughs> um, you know, Zemeckis' army and Confiner's army down a little more, they might be okay. I'll just move all of them. 
Yeah, that won't be too bad. To Orkney. So that's your defensive team? For right now, at least. Alright. And that's all I'm doing for my organization. Now, I will hand it to you. What'd it do? I don't know where I heard that from. I just think that's hilarious. <laughs> it's kind of stupid, but it's... I don't know. Anyways, so I went up a level. I have more scorpions here. I also have this here. Which I can't quite equip. It should be really cool. I have two Jinpoos. <laughs> uh, can I change anything around? I got five points there. And I'm over. I'm over. Whoa, this thing's level 14. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay, uh, let's put a fairy here, because that'll round me out there. So I'm taking Gala with me. Now, usually I would probably level Gala up, but this is kind of tough. And I've already got some decent leaders, and Vinard's attacking me like freaking crazy, so... I'm just gonna leave that the way that is. For some reason, he just doesn't like you. Oh, no. No, 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 he does not. If I were him, I wouldn't like you either, but that's just me. Well, you're weird like that, so... Yeah, but I'm, I'm playing this Kai, and Kai doesn't like you. Do this time, for, <laughs> for a little while. Well, for a little bit. Not attacking each other right at the moment, but that could change. You really want to come after Kai? <laughs> if I have to, I will. <laughs> So, that was a good thing about that. We've actually kind of uh, cauterized this spot here <laughs> with this team sitting on Orkney. Yeah. So now I can take my Yorsa team over to Gloom. So now I can attack with my super powerful team. I even might attack with my secondary team too, just to start pushing things around. Well, then we, we get, a, you get a dual attack that way. Yeah, that way I can start to push up a little bit faster. I'm still going to defend here with this same team. I'm not going to change anything. I think this team is pretty good. I don't see myself having to change anything. Like, I'm probably going to go with uh, Luca instead. Yeah. I don't know. Daffy could be a good one to use, too. Luca has a little bit more rune power. Daffy's a little bit stronger. But I think I'm going to go with rune power because I got Badge of Amos and Camden here. So I'm going to take a, a, a knight with rune power here. Yeah. So that's probably the option. I mean, I could go with Victoria, but her rune power is terrible just terrible. Like, if, if I was going to do this without Cortina, I would put Victoria under his team instead of Cortina, if I didn't have Cortina. Yeah. Because even though it's not enough room power, she's at least a mage. I could work with that, you know? Yeah. So... Yep, so that's where we're going to position. I'm moving uh, them to Gloom. Let's look at the domain. Carleon is climbing up there, dude. Wow. You're really close to, to uh, beating me in points there. Yeah, Very well could start to beat me in points pretty soon here. I'm only one. one unless unless Finer keeps attacking me over and over and over again, <laughs> then well, that'll be a different story, you know. Yeah, but eventually you're gonna knock him down to where it's like, uh, oh, I can't do this anymore. I'll just. Vinard cannot compete with me too much anymore, as mm -hmm. is, because you destroyed an army here, you know, or you know, well, this is the Empire, but now Vinard has to put up to four armies instead of just three. So now he has to worry about you, and you've got a super powerful team here, as do I. I think Viner will go as there. As do I, but it's going to split. Oh, well, he has to put a team here. Um, I'm saying, I think Viner himself will go there to face off against Kai. He might. I don't know. He's lost to me so many times, he might be like, ah, forget it. No, Dr Drist is that, just destroying well, me. I'm going to go and fight Kai The first time now. I fought him was just on Elmery, because I had to cut through Zemeckis to get to Viner. Yeah. Yeah, so that's pretty much what we're going to do. And uh, hopefully you enjoyed this. Um, next turn, you're going to see some battles here. Probably what I'm going to do, if Viner's still here, whether he's here or not, I'm going to attack Talos pretty quickly because this is a capital. Yes. This will give me more rune power. And if my secondary team's good enough, they're going to attack Whistle. Uh, for Paul's end, well, you're sitting on Orkney, you know, pretty nice. I'm yeah. thinking you might attack here, but I don't know if you're going to just sit and wait. Well, I got to see. I want to see what the uh, because. The this is what he has here right up. now, so he might not change this. Kador's sitting here with a lot of ready-to-attack leaders. Yeah. And Zemeckis is here with almost nothing. Well, that can change. I mean, Zemeckis might come back after you pretty hardcore. Organize though. is not what they what they 
they attack more is what they have in the castle, which we don't know where they're moving or what they're going to put in certain areas. Yeah, I think you're going to have a lot of lot of aggression against you. You got the umpire that's really pissed off at you right now with two castles ready to strike. Why? I'm a and nice Norgard. guy. I'm a nice and guy. And Norgard. All but we got to worry about right now is maybe this. But they haven't even attacked us at all, so I don't I don't know if they ever will. But li but listen, listen, I'm a nice guy. Doesn't matter. Well, not to them. Reinhardt's going to attack all of us. He doesn't care. And the Empire wants to destroy everything. Sorry you're sad, but... <laughs> sad but true. <laughs> so anyways, that's what we'll get to. Um, don't need to do much else here. We'll just show you some of the battles and what's going on. We'll talk about it as we get to the next attack video. Thanks a lot for watching the Organized Phase.